Welcome to Kensho Quest. In this video, I'm going to show you what's in my crossbody travel purse. Our family is traveling long term. We're currently in beautiful Hua Hin, Thailand. So please subscribe for packing tips and travel inspiration. Hello. We are Kensho Quest. We travel to open our minds and our hearts. Let's make friends around the world. Let's take a look at what's in my crossbody clutch for travel. This is a Lily Jade crossbody wristlet in the black leather. I wear this every day, whether we're getting ready for an airplane flight, I can keep our passports close to my body in this, or if I'm just making a quick errand out, taking my baby out for a walk, I wear this every day out sightseeing, it's always on me. So this is my trusty travel purse. I really like a crossbody style purse for traveling and it works great that I can wear the small purse while I'm also wearing my baby in the baby carrier and I can have my Lily Jade diaper bag on my back. Let's open it up. I love the jade lining on a lot of the Lily Jade bags. It's my favorite color. Right here, I'm just gonna take this out quickly is a piece of paper where I keep my phone number and address in case I don't have them memorized, but also just to show anybody it's easier having it written down. Next up, I have just my passport for when I'm running quick errands. Sometimes I'll also have all the family's passports together in the diaper bag if we're all going out together. Then I have my cell phone. I was hoping that this particular purse would work as a wallet on its own because it does have some organization I'm going to show you in a second, but this back pocket here, I didn't want to put cash just totally loose in it, so I do have a really thin wallet. This goes along with another bag that I purchased from my Needlecraft design. I'll link their Etsy shop below, but it's just super thin and it happens to fit really well inside this purse. It doesn't take up a whole lot of room. I do also have a Lily Jade wallet, but this is quite big. So it couldn't fit over on this divide section here. It could fit on the bigger side, but that would really like take up the whole purse. I wouldn't be able to fit my other items. So I like having a super thin little wallet just to keep my cash organized and separate. It's only supposed to be cash in there. I can hear some coins wiggling around. Let me take those out, put them where they're supposed to go. The other item I have on the smaller side is just the key for the resort where we're currently staying. Okay, so this pocket here, ah, I do have a couple other items. I have my pen. We always bring our own pen for airplane flights for filling out forms or filling out forms at the bank. Just anytime it's good to have a pen on us and it's good to have an extra hair tie. Okay, so this is kind of a smaller pocket. It's sort of what's meant to keep your cash in. And then the other side of the division is actually the bigger, wider pocket here. So first I will pull out my coin purse. This is a leather coin purse by Orchid Hearts. They make these really cute little heart ones that I just love and I love the teal color. So I'm gonna go ahead and add my 10 bot coin and five bot coin in there. I've been collecting the 10 bot coins for my kids because they like to put them in little machines and get a toy when we're out at the mall. I always try to remember to carry our Osmo Pocket gimbal video camera. This is so small, it's so lightweight, it's a perfect kind of video camera to fit in a purse. But I remember what camcorders were back when I was a kid. Some of my friends' families had them and they were huge and they were heavy. But this can take really nice, smooth, steady video and it's so small. Okay, so some other items down here. I have my Etik lip balm. We brought a lot of Etik solid travel toiletries with us. I like that they are low waste, zero waste brand. So this is a cardboard tube. It's getting a little old there. I won't be wanting to replace that soon. A small flashlight. I think that's just a good thing to have. You never know when the power might go out or you might have to find your way home in the dark or you may need to find an item down at the bottom of your purse at night. I have a few items for going to the restroom. Here in Thailand, there's often no toilet paper in the bathroom or they might sell little tissue packs like this. So I just try to remember to bring a tissue pack along. Although my toddler often takes it out of my purse. So it always seems to go missing when I actually need it. I have some of these little soap tabs in here. This is by Honey Bees. They're an Etsy shop located on Oahu. I'll link their shop below. I like these because I can actually rip it up and each family member can share one sheet. So it's lasting us a long time. 
just in case there's no soap in the bathroom. And then especially now during the current times, I like to have something to really clean my hands. So these are some alcohol prep pads that I can use if I need to kind of disinfect my hands. You can see how the leather is slouching down really nice now. I have this thing packed pretty full there. It is getting heavy if my coin purse is too full. Now one thing I really liked about this particular clutch is the way that the divider here has these card slots. So I'm using them just for our store get discount cards like Big C. I think my husband has some of these in his wallet too. I have the one card. So just different discounts we would get here in Thailand. I find it a little hard to get these in and out, especially when I'm wearing this and then I'm also wearing my baby. So ones that I want to keep more secure, I keep them in the zippered pocket right next to it here. So store cards, things that wouldn't matter so much if they were to fall, I keep on that side. Something money related, I keep zipped up. Sometimes when you're traveling, one debit card may not work in a particular ATM for a particular bank. So I always like to carry two and then I keep a third at home in the safe box just in case if my purse were to get stolen. Luckily, I've never had that happen. Overall, this bag is pretty lightweight. These chains add a little bit of weight, but you can unhook them and put a different strap on if you want. And it also comes with a little wristlet strap as well. If I was just going to pack this inside of another bag, like as a pouch, then I might use it in the wristlet configuration, but out and about on a travel day, I really do like it to have the crossbody strap on it. Lily Jade sells some more colorful, fun straps you can use as well. If this looks like the crossbody purse for you, I will leave my affiliate link in the description box below. We really appreciate the commissions we earn when you purchase through our affiliate links. And let me know in the comments below what you like to pack in your travel purse. Wishing you safe travels.